Hello there. Today, what we're going to talk about is racism. Fucking racism, eh? It's it's the most disgusting fucking thing in the world, I think. And I've been seeing quite a bit of racism lately. And one of them is off uh, a program I'm a program that I like to actually watch myself. You know, called The Breakfast Club. I'm sure you've all heard of it. Now, I'm sure you've all heard of a man called Charlemagne the God. Now, I don't get it why he is so fucking racist <laughs> when he gets on about the white man all the time, calls with mayonnaise and fucking all sorts, you know. And it's disgusting. And do you know what it is? What's, what hurts the most is that I actually like the, da- like the guy. I like Charlemagne, I think he's a good lad. He's the only one on there though, on the breakfast club, that seems to have a fucking problem. Who seems to be racist. And it's it's not like one or two times he's fucking come out with racial slurs. It's quite a, quite a lot of it, you know. He fucking, he can't stand white people. I can tell that now. At first, I thought, oh, he's, he's got a bit of a beef him. He's, he must have had like a bit of shit with like a white person this weekend. But no, it's like, it's all the fucking time with that guy. And like I say, I like him, and I'm, I still want to like him, but he's making it fucking hard to like. You know what I mean? I mean, DJ Envy and Angela Yee, they are fucking fantastic, them two. They're not fucking coming out with fucking racial slurs all the time. Just Charlemagne. I didn't get what his problem is. And I understand, I mean, fucking hell, I understand that a long time ago, black people were made to be slaves for white people. But I mean, we 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 are still white people nowadays are still getting shit over it. You know what I mean? Still fucking as if it was us that personally did it. And if this is what we're gonna do, an eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth, you know, like you, you can't live your life like that. It's fucking, it's no good. Otherwise, we're never ever gonna get anywhere. You know what I mean? Otherwise, in 50 year time. You know what I mean? It's still gonna be the fucking same or a hundred year time. Nothing's ever gonna improve, ever. Not if we keep going on where we are like this. I mean, it's, it's fucking, I, I didn't get what's so hard about people understanding that we're all just the same. We are, we're all just the fucking same. All this racism shit, it's, it's well that's exactly what it is, it's shit, racism shit. It's fucking, it's no good to nobody. And like I say, people like Charlemagne the God, he should be fucking trying to like encourage inclusiveness and like for fucking I mean otherwise his ancestors will be like looking at him going what a fucking prick you are we had it hard so you can have it easy do you know what I mean you should just fucking consider yourself lucky wait that's in a way that's a wrong word to say but in a way it's right you should be considering yourself lucky that he was born nowadays when there is a lot more social fucking acceptance to racial integration than there was in the old days, in the 60s and the 70s and stuff like that. You know what I mean? I mean, fucking, back in, back in the 70s and that, if a, if a white girl had a black boyfriend, the whole town and the whole village would fucking hate her for her. And it's fucking, that's disgusting. I mean, what the fuck? Just because two people want to be with each other. But, like I say, Charlemagne the God, he just doesn't seem as if he wants to fucking ever, ever give the white man the lickings of a dog. <laughs> it's fucking, it's crazy, isn't it? And I mean, this guy, yeah, he's a fucking role model. He's someone who people can look up to and, like, try and aspire to be like, you know what I mean? I mean, if, if my kids could fucking be like him and get yourself, get myself, like, a good, good job like that, you know what I mean? Working for a radio station, we fucking good on them, you know what I mean? But him, he's just, he's a fucking strange fucking man. Honestly, he's a strange man because he's, it's like as if he doesn't want things to get better, as if he doesn't want people to fucking get on. He's always trying to like create the wedge in between them and he's always trying to remind like black people from nowadays. He's, he's always like basically fucking pointing out, look, don't ever forget. And he's right, we shouldn't ever forget, but we shouldn't ever like not try and like improve on future fucking relations with each other. Fucking hell, man. I, I didn't get it. I, I look at black people like they're cool as fuck. They are. They're fucking proper cool. Black people, you know what I mean? They're, they're fucking awesome. They seem good at everything. <laughs> they're good at fucking, like, 
I don't know, like stuff like in the Olympics. It's always like fucking the old, awesome runners, the awesome dancers, awesome singers. <laughs> you know what I mean? These are fucking like role models for us as well, you know. We all should be looking at each other like role models and like I say Charlemagne the God, he just it's as if he doesn't fucking want it. It's as if he always wants it to be separate all the time and you know what I mean? You think back to the days like people like Rosa Parks and people like that who who actually did fucking have to fucking put up with fucking pure shit. And I'm not like I say, I'm not saying fucking Charlemagne the God's had a fucking like easy his whole life or hard his whole life. I'm not saying either way. What I'm saying is that if he just tried to fucking tone down on his racism a bit, especially when he's in a public fucking, I mean, he's, he's on the internet and that, you know what I mean? He's like, people people want to watch his shows, but when he comes out with all this shit, you know, and you just think, what a fucking prick, you know? What, why be like this? And like I say, Angela E and DJ Envy, fucking awesome. Awesome at what they do. I, I can't fault them for their job, but Charlemagne, you just need to sort yourself out, mate. Just tone down on your racism a bit, and maybe some people might start getting along better, you know? <laughs> but, like I say, man, this is something we all have to fucking work on, isn't it? But, hopefully, in the future, you never know. Fucking everyone might just be the same. We might just all fucking be the same, and actually fucking accept that we're the same. Until then, we just have to keep doing whatever this shit is. Anyway, I hope you like the video, like it, share it, subscribe. Someone fucking please tell Charlemagne about this video because I want that little shit to fucking say it. Like I say, I don't just dislike you Charlemagne, I just dislike how you're going about things. Anyway, take care guys, see you later.